Hi from Tokyo. If uh, you watch this video, probably you have uh, same headache. This is a Chinese incubation machine, which uh, makes me headache about one week, more than one week actually. Uh, I search a lot how to use this, and then this come already broken, doesn't work. Connect to the seller, and then we make conversation, and I make uh, dispute many 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 things past then I can't find any solution then I I understand that I have to fix this machine by itself now this is HHD Chinese incubator I think HHD mean headache headache and dead this machine when come doesn't work it's heat up to the 4045 it's go overheat then I didn't understand what is the problem I search user manual or someone as me have some problem on internet I can't find any solution and I decide to make this video for you to maybe help someone that I will show you how to how to use how to set and then how to solve the problem now as you see inside egg inside I cannot show inner part in this video after egg hatching I hope I will make it another video and then I will show you inner part and how to fix it okay as you see now uh, humidity work and then uh, my setting is 37.6 celsius and it's work but I don't trust it I put simple uh, this IKEA's machine like this IKEA's uh, temperature thing I put one of them inside to the check inner uh, temperature because this thing show here and then inside is uh, looks little different it doesn't work uh, good and also now you cannot see here one humidity manual humidity checker I check humidity with that I don't trust here but uh, as I check about one week now humidity is looks similar it's ev everything looks okay just some time uh, heating problem I have it's heat up too much inside it goes 38 39 degrees I calibrate it now I go about 37 sometimes it goes 38 but it's fall again this egg machine all automatic and all HDD uh, incubator I check on internet all is similar so just uh, function and setting all is similar if you have another model of uh, Chinese incubator you can make it same setting it doesn't be problem I think uh, this uh, black dot uh, must be egg <laughs> and this is uh, how many minutes later how many hours later it will turn turn this way and this way it's sixth day and this is uh, heating indicator this mean heating start working now and this is fun indicator fun turning this is humidity and this is uh, degrees if humidity alarm you can see one more humidity mark here this means it's inside too much dry or too much wet Mm, but the, this machine doesn't set humidity for just you put water inside uh, yesterday I put about two bottle of I show you bottle two uh, two bottle of this water first I make two channel full when I put egg then yesterday it start drying this go to the 40 I put two bottle water inside I set the egg this is on off button you power up from here and you set up from here and you change the setup from here and this is as you see uh, candling function but this thing if you don't make full of it it looks little hard to understand for amateur um, as I see now all egg is looks okay but still early and this thing open part should if you don't put egg on there you have to sh uh, you should close the light you have to put paper or something when you open the light this thing doesn't make too much bright around you cannot see here 
if you don't close here this area or my egg in this here uh, this part this part is free now okay this is open candling light and close candling light this is reset button when you see everything set up uh, when you open uh, you start the power you set up all everything okay then you have to push reset button reset button uh, reset turning timer and reset the day too they will be zero and this uh, turning time will be zero reset button for this okay now we can push one time and we can see temperature we set up this is my temperature which uh, i set up how to change temperature is this you have to push this and you have to push minus plus button example for just a sample i will make 37 and you have to push here to set up if you don't push here it doesn't get memory see it's on the memory now and i have to turn it back 37.6 i set up as you see our setup recorded don't forget the double check now we set up our temperature which we like then we have to go next setup okay first we set up low temperature alarm which alarm is too low uh, warn us we push uh, set button and we wait two three seconds to enter the alarm setting function alarm low function come and we push again second time then uh, setting function open as you see it is uh, one celsius degrees it this mean uh, minus one after minus one from uh, here from here example uh, 36.6 alarm start to walk and warn me that your uh, heater go to low temperature inner temperature of the here go to low then second function is alarm high this is also sa same but i uh, i don't want it to go too much high i make it the 0 0.5 it's got 38.1 alarming me calibrate and check inside this one again this is too much important because this thing <laughs> i don't trust okay you have to put inside one uh, thermometer and my one humidifier uh, I plan to buy one. Some small device show both of it. One of them I will take and I will put inside. And I will I plan to modify this one. As you see, I cross around. We will talk about this tape later. Now we go uh, alarm high. Okay, alarm low. Then we have alarm high. Zero point five. We set. You can set up here and then you have to push set up button to get memory don't forget it okay next uh, is humidity setting okay a5 is humidity setting push on it you see it's 40 you have to make it this one until you set up your humidity if you have some problem and you cannot solve it make it one and then get the memory you have no alarm okay many of this machine has problem on humidity part alarm starting you have to come push button and then start again you have to come push again and then start again really this second age second headache is that one first age is doesn't work anything now we have uh, humidity setting is one important setting in here second one okay this uh, machine have three important settings you have to do hum humidity alarm stop you have to go and you have to set up this humidity part other one is you have to set up this one which temperature you want you hatch your egg okay then third one is calibration this is very very important setting as we go here you see one point uh, one point four i will show you i will show you now demonstrate why i did that okay this thing you see here show uh, perfect degrees which i said but this is normally wrong inside now i read 38 okay then i go if i don't calibrate this okay 
I add this one one point four. So I zero it, then see what happened. This is zero factory setting. As you see here, low alarm start. Okay, this machine normally if factory setting, this machine shut up. This machine work thirty six point five on factory setting. Okay, let's go from here to thirty uh, thirty seven point six, which I said this one. Okay, then this means uh, one point four degree more heat inside here. Then this one will go to the thirty nine, and then the embryo died. Okay, this is important for you before you put egg. Make this calibration. If you uh, don't have one more thermometer to check inside, don't trust this machine. One month later, you understand machine doesn't work. Okay, you uh, probably you, your egg has no problem. Just machine cook them. Okay. Next setting. Next setting is calibration low uh, five and low high five. Okay, this is uh, highest temperature. You can make it uh, higher limit and lower limit to set up from here. Example, see uh, as you see here, I cannot go more than thirty eight because because I set high five to thirty eight degrees. If I make this one thirty, example, if I make it this to the forty, then this time I can make this and then I can go until the 40 it's for accidentally don't go too high and don't set too high temperature and don't make some wrong thing then I turn this again to the 38 because I have kit at home maybe kids play with it and then they can go to the too high okay this temp uh, setting is for that or they can go too low but here <laughs> one more problem here and now we will go to the low 5 and low 5 no more than 30 okay this machine goes 30 uh, you can make it lower temperature 13 you cannot make it uh, example 37 okay you know, someone cannot set up between 37 and 38 but you don't have that function you have maximum 30 to 38 example I can go like this until the 30 okay okay this is all setting for this and there is no any other setting uh, only you have to make this three settings one set up your temperature two if you have humidity problem alarming too much go to the humidity and make it one and push setup now no humidity alarm third setting okay you have to, you should make third setting if you don't make this setting you cannot get any chick from your egg okay that's one is more more important calibrate your machine put your temperature inside put your hum humidifier inside and check one week we can see what going on and start calibrate it every day until you get perfect match this one and inside thermometer should show same thing. If you have that, you have no any bet. Now, for humidity, I tap this one around. Okay. Then I get humidity normal because this part is open and uh, humidity run away too easy. Easy, and we have to put again and again and again water inside. As you see, it start to turn. Okay, it work like this. Okay, this is Chinese HHD uh, incubator. This uh, type is really bad design. Uh, the fan and the uh, heater should be upside for easy to clean and get no any problem on it. Uh, this one is underside. Then uh, one mesh on there. Lockdown. We have to take this egg turner green uh, yellow uh, yellow piece outside. Then we have to put all egg on the that plastic mesh. 
then wait till the chick come out. When chick come out, chick can fall down around, and this fun can kill the chick, close all the gap, then chick cannot go down, deep down. The one modification you have to make at lockdown time is that. The other thing is uh, when you put water from here, you, you really cannot see inside. Okay, you have to pack. Well, we have to make one pipe in there, and you have to put from there. You have to connect this one to the pipe, then push it like that, and you understand. Uh, end of the pipe is right down inside the channel. You don't damage anything. So I hope this video help you for hatching your eggs. If you like it, or if you have any question, please please write it on the comment. If I forget to explain something, I will try to explain in, explain in there. In our part, we will see next video when I take all egg out. Okay. And then this character, all my little kids make. The lovely character. This one is Ampaman, Ampaman and Ampaman's friend. <laughs> they wait chick come out from the Ampaman. This one is uh, a Kachaman. Thank you for watching. See you in next video.